happy Friday. <laughs> I'm Chiffon, pronouncing them like the material, and welcome back to my channel. So I'm starting off the weekend vlog. Ooh, I just took that scarf off thing. I um, laid my edges down a little bit, and I had my sleepy tie in. So this is day seven since I've washed my hair and put my sleepy tie in. So has that like blowout look. Um, so yeah, so I'm getting ready to go to Baltimore. It's like a girl's trip and we're driving down there. Um, and we're going to, so my friend is having a conference. So she's a PMR, um, a medical resident. So she's had a conference down there. So we're going to go down there and hang out and we're going to go to DC. So this is my car outfit. I'm trying to like fix it up a little bit. But yeah, I'm excited. We should have some fun in DC. We're going to go to like an Afro Beats conference. Y'all, I ignore this. So I have got some outfits from the drop and I tried them on and they don't fit like I would like them to. So I'm returning them. Anywho, this is my outfit. I got the, just the same jean shirt that I wore, I think last weekend probably. Um, it's really comfy just wearing in a car. Then I have leggings from, um, uh, Amazon and then my boots Ta -da! these are very comfortable these are from oh that's my conditioner hold on y'all if y'all can't hear my ear conditioner like that but it's so loud like I just turn it off because it annoys me but anywho this is my outfit let me put my glasses on so I can see because I didn't put my contacts in but this is my outfit um the boots are Stuart Weitzman Stuart Witzman I'll link them below Ta-da! I did an unboxing of them and I really love them they're so comfy but yeah, this is the look. And I already packed my clothes. Woo, I'm, I was sweating, like not sweating, but I was hot from packing my clothes. That's why I put my air conditioning on. And these glasses are dirty. But y'all, I wanted to just show y'all the painting. I ended up putting the painting up. So let me show y'all. Ta-da! Let me see if the, I don't have any lights on in here. Even know if that did anything let me back y'all up so now you can see all three of them cute right oh my gosh oh let me see Ooh. okay about them i mean like i feel like it ate along like it draws everyone's eyes up when they come into light relax it draws everyone's eyes up when they come into my place so i'm starting to like get like posting or hanging paintings and buying bigger vases draw draws people's eyes up and it makes the room look even bigger um so i did get this new um vase too from cv2 i think i might have showed y'all on another vlog but i end up getting it and here it is it's so cute right so that's the painting i did like a couple of weeks ago and then i put the um vase on this table it's so cute let me zoom in so y'all can see the detail look at that oh my gosh so 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 cute and it's not heavy either so i'm going to get some plants to put in like i'm going to make like a fall arrangement and put it in there so yeah it's going to be so cute made it to baltimore <laughs> so this is my oh, y'all my hair looks crazy this is my i guess first time really being in Baltimore so I've been in Baltimore once but I was only here for like an hour or two because I just went to like a crab shack to celebrate 
um, my friend graduating and then I left. So this is my first time really here before. I mean, here for real. My shirt is all wrinkled from the car. And I was in a tussle going up the stairs with these bags. So let me do a hotel like room tour real quick. So that's the door. So this is called the Real Sinesta. I've never been here before. This is the first time. So this is in the Inner Harbor. Then they have like others anywhere, somewhere else. But this is my first time being here. So when I come in, this is the king. This is the king room. It has like a foyer. I guess that's what this is called. Um, so it has this cute coffee place here. A mirror. It's good lighting in here. And they have a cabinet down there. The um, refrigerator is probably down there, but I don't feel like looking. Um, there's a little closet area. Of course, the super cute Mara. And then here's the restroom. So I love that painting. Good lighting in here. And this is the bathroom. I mean, the bathtub. Like, it's just a regular tub. I like how they, uh, what is that? Oh, soap must have spilled from this soap dispenser. I need to take a shower too. Okay. All right, let's, so let's go into, oh, here's another painting if y'all wanted to see. Now this is the room. Cute, right? Modern, it smells fresh in here, no mildewy because that's what be happening in some of these hotels. This looks good. Updated TV, like everything seems to be modern a little bit. Um, well, not a little bit, it's definitely modern. Uh, here's another mirror. I love that they have a whole bunch of mirrors and the lighting is pretty good. There's this little cute area. I like how it has two areas. So my friends are gonna, let me see so y'all can see me. My friends are gonna come by after I'm finished getting dressed or done getting dressed and then we're gonna like, um, you know, hang out, chit chat, and then go to our party. But it has a huge window here. I guess floor to ceiling, I guess. <laughs> yeah, floor to ceiling, floor to ceiling, maybe. Not floor to ceiling, but almost. My view isn't that great. All I see here. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> you can see a little something. So that's the harbor. Um, Phillips, I think that might be a popular um, place that people go to. That's the water. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to show you guys in the morning. Beautiful. I'm just gonna get ready. All right, I have to do my hair real quick. All I did was um, put a sleepy tie in before I got into the shower. I have the one midnight. It's so cute, right? So, there it is. I had it in for about, um, I don't know, 30 minutes. Doo -doo. Here it, did, nails did. I do need a comb real quick. All right, I'm back. So I had to run and get a comb. All right, so I got this holter top on. So, looking good. I don't feel like bringing out the flat iron for this little piece, so. I do wanna do my flat iron my size real quick. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. But it looks cold. So, this is my hair. I'm gonna flat iron my hair real quick in a second. I'm kind of like, not in a rush, but kind of in a rush because we're in Baltimore, but we have our party tonight is in DC, so we have to drive there. I think I may put in some tapes because I got this. Okay, so this top I have on is super cute. It's from MB Finale. I bought this a while ago. Like, I, um, yeah, so I don't know when. Oh, it's been a while. And I got it in a large, but I probably. I don't know, like, okay, so this part is fitted, but the top is sliding down a little bit. 
and it does have these little things that's supposed to stick to your body but i think it's just a little bit like not i don't want to i feel like it's fitting perfectly i don't know maybe i'm not doing something right but maybe if i get fabric tape I did bring some, so I'm gonna do that because I I wanted to I wanted to sit up here. That's the thing, and I guess it's some people like it sitting down here. That's probably where it's supposed to go. But I wanted to sit up here. This is cute. Do y'all like it? So it's from MB Finale. I love MB Finale. So this is where the top is from. I got some stirrup leggings from. Starts with a C. I'll link them below. I wore these in my last week's vlog. Y'all, when I buy stuff, I wear it. Like, I wear it, wear it. My shoes are Gia Couture. Let me back up. Y'all, oh, y'all ain't even seeing that. Let me see. Ta-da! I'll do a full body pick thing. Um. All right, so for I did my makeup. For my lip, I think I am going to do a lip liner. Girl, I ain't wear lipstick and lip liner in so long. I just been rocking my Anastasia clear lip gloss. But today I'm feeling like spicy. So girl. I just I just wipe my lips with the um my makeup eraser because I did my foundation. You know how sometimes the color and stuff can get on your lips? And some people like that. I wipe it off. Uh, so this is having a hard time going on my lips because my lips are so dry. I just got a message from Blackboard. I need to figure out when I want my Blackboard to send a message because why is y'all texting me at this time of day? All right. I might have put too much on. Girl. Mmm. This is not, this is not it. I put too much lip liner on. And I don't like when the wand gets dirty, so. I think I've grown so accustomed to just my regular lip color that when I do anything else, I'm like, you know. Because I put too much brown. I guess that's better. I don't know, but I really, I don't like that my wand is brown now. Cause I don't want to put the brown. I need one of those individual dippers. Darn. Yeah, I don't want my wand to be brown. Cause I don't want it to make the the clear color brown. That's not cute. I don't know why the light keep changing. Okay. This is going to do. I really don't have to flat iron. Come on, light. I'm sorry, y'all. I should have did something to not make that happen. But yeah, so this is it. Y'all, it's like 5.30 in the morning and I'm eating a chicken sandwich. So I got home, back to the hotel, got in the shower. I mean, it's chicken sandwich. It was a good time tonight. So we went to, I don't even know what this place was called, St. Yves or something. And we actually bought tickets to go there. We, and it was, um, it was basically a higher alumni Afrobeats party, but 
when we got there, they were at capacity, but we're like, well, we paid for our ticket already, but they didn't care. So we ended up going to park and that was fun. They have like four or five levels, I can't remember, but each level plays different music. Like you can kind of feel the vibe for each level. Like the first level, when you first walk in, there's like a lot of VIP people, like I guess 30s, 40s around that age and then you go in the back they were playing like regular hip-hop r&b then you go in the back room they were playing a lot of afro beats that was fun then like it was like playing glorilla one um two but glorilla but they ended up doing afro beats and then uh, the second floor was like another vibe third floor fourth floor there was one floor that had like um, like the typical music that you hear when you're leaving the club, but they was playing it the whole time, like songs that you sing to, excuse me y'all, those type of songs. I enjoyed the Afro Beats, um, section, even though it was like a, the crowd was a little bit younger there. You were, I would say like 75% of the people were probably a little bit younger than me. Maybe 25% was my age or a little bit older, but it was cool. But yeah, it was brutal driving back. You know, I wasn't driving. My friend was driving. It's still exhausting riding in an hour in a car for an hour to get back to Baltimore. So I'm like, dang, should I just have stayed in like at my hotel in DC? But it is going to be nice to wake up to the water and explore um, Baltimore and go to the aquarium. Um, so now I'm just watching this TV. I, right now it's 90 Day Fiance. I ain't going to watch that so long. Anywho, I'm going to eat my sandwich. I ain't have a chicken sandwich in so long. This is from Burger King. And I bought some pickles from the grocery store. These are so good, y'all. Let me show y'all. Oh, it's not pickles. Not the grocery store, the gas station. And I put them on top because I love pickles so much. Got my sleepy time. Going to bed. Bye. Y'all. <laughs> so I got up so late. I woke up at 11 a.m. because I put my alarm uh, that late. And I literally woke up at that time. I typically wake up like around 7 a.m. in the morning usually. But y'all know I went to bed like at 530 so i'm getting ready to go to the aquarium i wanted to show y'all what i'm wearing i am wearing i don't know why i'm walking around so i'm wearing this top that my niece made it's so cute it's a t-shirt and it says different on there and she actually drew this y'all cute i'm wearing my frankie shop blazer i just um rolled the sleeves up so it can be like, I don't know, the, the direct jacket is very structured and I really like folding the sleeves up because it creates this like look here. I just love that. Um, and I have my Amazon leggings on. Girl, I got three pairs of them, like 10 out of 10. I really love them. And then I'm wearing the boots from Stuart Weitzman again. <laughs> because I'll be walking around a lot. So these, these boots are like really, really comfortable. They're the 75 mm. Then I'm of course gonna wear my Amazon bag so I can be like handsless and stuff. And then I'm wearing my scent from Valentino. This one here. So let me see if I can give y'all a full look. Ugh. Can y'all see all the way back here? Do y'all see something? <laughs> if not, I'll put um Look at thing on my side. So y'all, let me sit down. I'm waiting for my friend to come so we could uh, go to the aquarium. I really like this bed. Oh, let me sit on this chair actually, cause the chair is cute. So y'all, let me tell y'all. So, oh, the lighting ain't that great. Oh, that's my alpha for tonight. So, <laughs> okay, so yesterday, Everything is in a rush. Everything is like rush, 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 rush. And the older I get, I do not be wanting to rush. And yesterday, 
I was rushing and um I would y'all know like I like to do if y'all don't follow me on Instagram I really like to do uh like my videos of my outfits and stuff like that it's really fun and I'm starting to do more of them on TikTok too so you can follow me on TikTok if you want to see those um my makeup looks like really good today I'm so happy I switched that concealer oh my gosh like y'all the born this way this concealer 10 out of 10 and i changed it to the color i need it and it looks so good like i don't look washed out anymore mm. okay anywho so let me tell y'all so i did couldn't finish the um the reels i was making and i was like whatever i'm just gonna go like the lighting was off because it was dark and it was just oh excuse me um not looking too good Girl, why did this morning, I was like, let me just put that outfit back on and finish the reel. <sighs> I can't believe I really did that, but this that outfit last night was too good. Like that feather top, that feather top was too, so good. And I was like, I need people to see this so they could get this top. Like this top, the top was really, really cute. So y'all, y'all the only ones who know that I literally took that outfit off got up in the morning, got dressed, and put it back on just to make a reels. So if you're a real one, <laughs> go on Instagram and drop a, mm, I would say pink, but sometimes everybody know I love pink, so they do pink. So drop a red heart. So drop a red heart if you come in from YouTube and you know that I put that uh, dress, that top on to record the um, reels the next day, like. That's crazy. I can't. I've never did anything like that before. But that outfit was just too good. That top was too good. I really love that top a lot. Um, it was actually the perfect size. So I really like the heart shaped thing. And I actually did put some um, boob tape on to hold it up some more because I like stuff to be higher than what some other people may like it. Uh, maybe like I wanted it to ride an inch higher, but I really like how the body like that around around the stomach was more form fitting. And then the part up top kind of like formed around, you know, your breast. If I'm allowed to say that on YouTube. It formed around my breast. So it was like, I feel like that top can fit a lot of different people. Um even if they have different breast size. Like your waist can be cool, but it kind of formed around your breast. Like that was good. So yeah, I'm about to go to the aquarium. And I am like a I am like I'm out of breath. I could only do one thing in a weekend. When I say one thing, like go out, hang out with friends and stuff like that. Because your girl be tired. And when there be weekends when I do that two days in a row, oh The waterfall is so relaxing. I like it. This is a great view. Oh, sorry. Oh. You want to touch? Okay, touch, Touching up my face 
with this puff and I used some of the uh, Fenty uh, filter. I think that's what this party powder is called. The Pro Filter, yeah, and banana. Just to freshen up my makeup because I don't have time to do my whole makeup again because again, I'm going all the way to DC from Baltimore. So yeah, so this is my outfit. So I have Broken Land on. Y'all know I love Broken Land Co. So the top and the skirt and the shoes. Oh, the shoes are from hmm, Gia Contour. I'll do a whole fit. Like I'll do something on my side so you can see the whole, you know, fit. <sighs> My goodness, my feet are hurting. Not because of the heel. It's like rubbing when I was wearing my boots. I didn't bring any socks to put on or any stockings. So like they were rubbing. So they're like irritated. So tonight may be a long night. But I wanted to come back. I wanted to spin the block because I remember one of my um, vlogs I showed y'all I was going to use these two products from OH. So here is the, I don't know how to make it like not so bright. But this cream, so the OH Beam Cream and the Firming Body Oil. So I'll put that on and my legs look really, really good. I, wish, I wonder if y'all can see. <laughs> yeah, don't talk about me. So yeah, they look really good. So very moisturized. So I'm using that. Highly recommended. Um, it has a slight scent to it, but it's very light. And it won't um, take over the scent of your like perfume that you want to put on. Um, and I haven't had any allergic reaction to it and my skin is doing well on it. So no eczema flare ups. If you're new to my channel, I have dry sensitive eczema prone skin. So um, yeah, speaking of perfume, I'm using the Valentino because on vacation, I only bring like one or two scents. And this time I only brought one, which is this one. So I'm just using it. So yeah, my hair is still the same from this morning. I maybe did um, like one or two curls on the beginning and those kind of dropped throughout the day. But yeah, I think this looks cute. Mm -hmm. Let's go. This is so cute. Yeah, like for a, a date night. So this is the war. I, I like this water thing too. Guys, Dana got VIP on accident. <laughs> We're in VIP. But it was an R&B party. If the music was like regular music, but it, that's the type of party you go to that's like, you have a you have a man with you, not your girlfriend. You ain't gonna be bumping and grinding. <laughs> yeah. But it was a nice club though. It's probably good on regular days. They said like before it was R&B. Um, dirty guys at the end. Dirty guys? Oh yeah. I don't know what that was about. That's why when we left the elevator, I was like, you guys can go first. They were like, no, no, no. Like, y'all was so pressed to get on the elevator before. And then had a nerve to say, oh, yo, let me talk to you. No, I don't want to talk to you. You literally jumped over me to get on the elevator. Like, relax. I guess you couldn't see me. I was so little. Hey, y'all. Good morning. I'm getting ready to go to the clinic. It's Monday. Filling up my water bottle. I try to drink 64 ounces a day because I'd be thirsty. <laughs> but no, I think it helps. It definitely, no, nah, I think it definitely helps with my eczema. Like just feel my eye hydrated. It's this weird thing also when I do my makeup. Um, and you know how you're putting like all this stuff on your face and then I drink the water and then I feel like I'm bringing moisture back to my face. I don't know if that's a mind thing or what. Mm. 
so get my water. Then I'm gonna make some coffee. Got this cute cup from Starbucks. I got this a while ago. Let's see what sweetener I want today. So I got a couple. I even got pumpkin spice, but I'm not really in a pumpkin spice mood. Hazelnut, vanilla, French vanilla, so they're all sugar free. I had um, salted caramel, but I obviously like that one because I'm out of it already. So maybe I need to get a bigger one of the, um, why is this lighting giving me bags? Oh, anywho, I think I'm gonna do hazelnut. Am I, do I want hazelnut? Maybe I'll do French vanilla. Oh, it's not even open. I don't feel like throwing all that. Actually, I'll, uh, I do feel like doing all that. <laughs> Y'all, let me get myself together. Why is this tag in this pan sticking out? Okay. I appreciate that they put the plastic on there and do this thing on top so it doesn't spill. But it be taking time out of my day in the morning. I'm not running late, but every second counts. All right, I'm going to do three tablespoons of this. Actually, I'm only going, I'm only going to do two. I'll put some almond milk in there. Just my outfit, so I just got pants on from H&M. I had these for like forever, just some slide pants. And I got this top from, I thought I got this from H&M too. What does that say? Oh, it says Zara. So I got this from Zara. <laughs> I'm a bat. <laughs> but yeah, then I'm going to put my clinic shoes on that I keep at clinic. Um, so yeah, getting my day started. Happy Monday. That's the end of this weekend vlog, y'all. I had fun in Baltimore. I really liked the aquarium a lot, 10 out of 10. The food was actually surprisingly good for like, you know, aquarium, zoo type of food. It was really good. Um, and not Sinesta Hotel. That's the first time I stayed there. It was like, okay. It was like, okay. So the decor was nice, but the walks use a paint job. Like I was, I'm just being nitpicky. But I also recently stayed at the JW Marriott and that hotel was beautiful. So my expectations are like real high right now when it comes to hotels. Um, but it was cool. It was like giving me Hilton vibes a little bit. But the service, customer service was giving me comfort in. Not saying that there was nothing wrong with comfort in, but like you can tell the difference when you stay at a really nice hotel compared to if you're staying at like a Comfort Inn or like a motel. Like even when I went to check out, I was leaving my room. Girl, check out was at 12 p.m. It was 12 on one of those people came knocking on the door and I'm like, I'm coming, you know, I'm coming and relax. And then they came again and I'm like, I'm coming. I said, well, when y'all gonna be done? I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna tell them you're checking out late because Look, I'm going to tell them you're checking out late and it's a late charge. I'm like, okay. <laughs> like, girl, I'm not even taking that long. Are you rushing me out of here? Whereas when I stayed at the JW, I, I called. 
and ask, let's say I'm taking a couple of minutes. They're like, oh, no problem, take your time. And I tried to call the CNS hotel, like the front desk, but nobody didn't answer because I was running a little bit late because I was tired. But I'm gonna put some Stevie in here. But I'm like, girl, why are you scolding me and like saying I'm gonna get in trouble or something like that? Like. Can you just relax a little bit? And the funny thing is, she's like, this is what she did. She said, <laughs> she said, well, what time are you gonna be done? She did one of that goes to me. I said, well, I'm trying to leave now. Are you uh and in my mind, I'm like, well, you holding me up talking to me for like five minutes, saying how long I'm taking to get out of here, where I could have actually been out of here if you wasn't holding me up. But I ain't say all that. But anyway. This is the end of the vlog. Please like this video, subscribe if you want to see more of me, and that's all. Peace and love.